Hi YouTube. Today I'm gonna be doing like a my previous video where I shot the, the 50 BMG 750 grain Amax into the barrel. Which today, to have one barrel, like on my previous video, today I got two. Which I'm gonna be shooting a 300 wind mag. I'll be shooting the Barrett again, 50 BMG. Let's put the mirror most on. Here. Take it out of my pocket. This is a, uh, I loaded this myself. This is a 300, uh, 300 wind mag, bronze tip. I wanted to see what it's gonna do to a barrel, which is over to my left. Then and again, I got the 750 grain AMAX bullet. And to give you a comparison, it's a 300 wind mag to the 750 grain AMAX, 50 BMG bullet. Because it makes the 300 wind mag look very small. So, what the goal is here, guys, is uh, the previous video, the 50 BMG 750 grain AMAX went all the way through the barrel. But instead of having the barrel standing up, this time the barrel's gonna be laying flat, both of them, to see if the 300 wind mag and the 750 grain AMAX still goes to the barrel. And it's still kind of damage we can do to the barrels also. So guys, let's get started. We're going with the 300 wind mag first, going to the barrel on the left. I'm using the Savage Model 110. And it'll be laying prone on this ordeal. Watch out, move my yoga mat. All right. Air plugs in. Air muffs. One in the chamber. Resume my scope. All right. Going to the barrel on the left. I'm going to try to go for dead center. Go for the barrel on the right, the 50 BMG, 750 grain AMAX. Flip up the sights. Here goes the barrel on the right. Chamber's clear. But guys, the bullet did go in. The 750 grand AMAX bullet did go in right there. Which is pretty close to the bottom of the barrel. And it swelled the barrel. On actually both sides. And let's see if it went through. No, it did not. So the projectile is still in the barrel. And it probably came apart, which I'm pretty sure. Alright, three and a wind mag. Swelled the barrel. Even swelled the top of the lid. 
the swell to the top a little bit. And to show you guys, I actually hit it. Because it just probably pretty much poked a small hole, which is right here. And it's not leaking water because, which is surprisingly, it's bleeding. I mean, it's leaking a little bit of water. Okay, guys, on the 750 grain Amax, as the projectile went in the barrel, it uh, came apart, and this is all that's left of the 750 grain Amax. But on the 300 wind mag, when it went in, it pretty much just came apart. And that's pretty much all that's left of the 300 wind mag. Pretty impressive, guys. Pretty impressive. But, guys, I hope you like what you've seen. Until next time.